Good evening. The first day of the Taste of Cincinnati is still going strong as thousands of locals and tourists alike flock downtown to give their taste buds a workout today. Not on your side's Roseanne Aragon hit the streets to find out what unusual dishes were drawing a crowd. She is downtown now live at the festival. Roseanne? The list of food items on the menus here seem endless, so we went on a hunt to bring you some of the foods that you can't usually eat every day. The taste of Cincinnati is a culmination of deliciousness, from your industry staples to the more bold options. So we went on a hunt to find some unique and unusual items on the menu. First stop, the goat cheese brown sugar cheesecake from Elfio's. Entice people to try goat cheese. Some of them are afraid or they don't care for it, but once you put it there, it should give you a little acidity and tang to a really rich dessert. Something Dixie White never thought she'd ever try. It was creamy and crunchy and really sweet. It was really good. From creamy and crunchy to hot and chunky, this is Bumblebee Stew, a special recipe Jay Gumbos has had for years. Stew with the sting. I'm going to give this stew a try. Luckily, there aren't any actual bumblebees in it. Wow, it's kind of spicy. Sweet and spicy. It's good. Now it's time for dessert. Well, this could arguably be both. One regular grilled cheese. The grilled cheese donut, it's our uh, glazed donut with a sharp cheddar cheese. So we cut it in half like a bagel, uh, flip it upside down, and we toast the outside in. How does it taste? It's amazing. It's the best thing I ever had. The best is what these 40 plus food booths aim to offer. But these vendors say it's uniqueness that takes the cake. People like these types of events so they can try stuff and it brings them right in. Now, I was a little sad that our food adventure had to end, but those are just three of hundreds of items that you can try here until Monday. Now, for a detailed guide on the festival and a schedule, you can visit our website at WCPO.com. Reporting live, Roseanne Aragon 9 on your side.